Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you know, my name is Tere, and today I'm gonna to be talking about why, again, I haven't been uploading. It's been a while, how you doing? You still here? The reason I haven't really been uploading is because last uh, week, I was actually in a car accident. A deer jumped in front of my car. <laughs> And I had no choice but to hit it. A lot of people are like, well, you could have pressed the brake. No, trust me. Well, once I literally saw its body in front of my car, there was no stopping it. Rona is dead. Like she did, did. Like Taylor Swift, she can't come to the phone right now. Why? Because she's dead, dead. It was actually funny because when the tow truck came and actually was towing her away, the oil was coming out of her and it looked like she was crying. And I was like, me too. But she protected me, like I'm still here. Um, luckily, if I would have pressed the, if I would have pressed the brakes, I would have hit a telephone pole head on. It was weird because I was literally I was literally a mile from my destination. Like it was over a hill. Over a hill. And I would have been there. But I haven't really been wanting to upload and be in front of you guys just because my hand is all messed up. Um I suffered like a a burn on my hand from the airbag. I think the force of the airbag made it like bruise. And then like the chemicals also got into the wound and made it 10 times worse. So literally all of this is like burnt. So I also didn't want to be on camera <laughs> because of that. Because I mean, I've had videos in the past where I had a pimple on my nose and I didn't want to be on camera. This is, um very bad and i have to like wrap it myself put ointment on it's 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 a nightmare um and then after the accident i also got a concussion and also there's something wrong with my mouth like every single time i go over the spot with my tongue it like feels like something's broken so i have to go to the dentist on monday about it wonderful um but the reason i'm making this video is because <sighs> let's talk grown-up stuff i know terrifying I, I i'm right there with you let's talk about grown-up things like core insurance core insurance listen i thought i had the proper core insurance <laughs> why am i saying quartz <laughs> why am i saying it like this i don't know but I thought I had the proper car insurance. It was good, it was good insurance. Like it got me a rental car. I didn't have to pay anything for my woundages. Um, and um, it is giving me a settlement check. The thing is, I lease my vehicle, I finance my vehicle through a bank. So when you finance your vehicle through a bank, what ends up happening is you have to go to your dealer and ask for gap insurance. What is gap insurance, you ask? Well, I'm gonna tell you because man, did I learn quickly. Gap insurance means that if you have, say your car, I think mine costs like $7,500, right, off the lot. Uh, it depreciated to 6,800. Eight hundred. So they gave me a settlement. My insurance gave me a settlement for six thousand eight hundred dollars to go towards the seven thousand five hundred. Great. Um, if I would have had gap insurance, it would have paid for the entire thing. I went to my dealership and was like, "Hey, y'all got gap insurance?" And he's literally looking down my paper like, "I don't see it on here." And I was like, "Because you didn't tell me." You know, like, I, <clears throat> so I owe six hundred dollars on my car. And it's funny because the first time I filed with the bank, they said, oh, the only reason you got approved was because you didn't put your rent down. Bitch. <laughs> like, <laughs> do you not understand that when I moved in here in May, I was paying that rent. Like, I got my car in September. Y'all knew I was paying rent. Like, they ran my credit. <laughs> To even get up on apartment, what you mean though? No. 
But they were like, no, you didn't give us your rent. So, no, you don't get the second loan. And I was like, it, what? So now I have to pay the $600 off myself, which means I've never asked people for money. I'm not one of those people who grovel for money. I usually make ends meet. I have never missed a payment on anything. Ever. Like, ever. So, like, uh, they were like, well, you need to make up this $600. So, that's where you guys come in. Um, I am including my PayPal. I'm including my Venmo. Um, if you guys can help, please help. Um, I don't do this at all. I don't, like, I like to handle things myself. I like to, you know, be an adult about it and be like, I'll handle it. But it's either this or turning in my camera, <laughs> which my camera is over $600. So I would have to start back from the very beginning of using my Samsung phone, which I don't want to do, but I will have to if this doesn't pan out. I know we're in a pandemic right now. Um, please don't be obligated to help me. This is just if you are... <laughs> you know, want this channel to continue, want to have this quality of camera, want to, uh, it would be great. Because also this car goes with my job. So if I lose this car, I have to go back to Ubering and lifting, which is fine. But the thing is, I get out at very late hours. So sometimes there's not an Uber or a Lyft out to come get me up. I'm walking at 11 p.m back at my place. Not the safest neighborhood I live in. Like, my, literally my neighbor is the nicest old lady ever and she got mugged. Like, straight up mugged. So like, if you guys can help, please help. Include your uh, name and username either on my YouTube comment section or on my PayPal or the Venmo or something like that. And I will uh, let you guys have exclusive videos, um, listen to your requests. I will do something to make it up to you. Um, I will also, in the future, if I get this car, we'll start kind of handling this better. Because I feel like every single time something happens, I get discouraged. I get sad. I just get discouraged about YouTube and wondering if I should even continue doing this channel or if I, anybody's even watching. Um, but I just feel when I get this way, like I'm inadequate in some way, in some form. And I'm not. I'm just very self-conscious when like I have wounds and things like that. Um, but if you guys could, that would be great if you guys could help. Again, we're in a pandemic. I understand. I'm, I would love a stimulus check. My God, where, what, what? That would be amazing. That would handle this whole problem. Government, not con trying to call the government out, but like, we need help down here. I'm just saying, a dur. Like, I'm trying to make me laugh because like right now I'm like screaming inside because um I did not anticipate this to happen like my Rona was my life like I don't think you understand how much I love just putting music on in my Rona and just being but it's interesting because literally I had Kitty's album in my car and after the accident, literally the C the CD came out perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. It's crazy to me. I don't know if it was meant to be. I don't know if it just happened. But like this CD was literally out of my car. Like Rona is damaged and dead. Like straight dead. And this CD was out of my car. Like I, I don't know how you survived, but I'm not going to complain. Um... It's just little things like that. I'm just like, Phew. but at the same time, things happen and I have to deal with them. So I haven't been in the mood to really react to anything. I want to get back into it. I want to actually feel okay reacting because those are my best reactions. But right now my life is completely falling apart and like I'm trying to keep it together. But inside I'm straight crying and screaming. Um, 
again, if you can help me, that would be a fantastic. If you can't, I understand. Like, I'm also poor. But the camera will be going. It hurts me to say that because I love this camera, but I gotta do what I gotta do first. Um, more videos will be coming. Please hold on me. Um, I do have some videos I haven't uploaded yet, but I think I'm gonna scrap like half of them because like I keep filming but like not recording because I don't have time with everything that's been happening and with me being, you know, in the hospital and things like that. I haven't really been having time to edit, um, but I do want to get back into it. I have a new room. Do you guys see this background? I worked hard on it. Billy is back there, Miss Billy. Kitty's up in the corner, Groot's right there, peace sign, Rick and Morty's right over there. Like, are you kidding? Like, I want more posters, I'm gonna get more posters, but this is my recording room so far, and I am very happy about it. Uh, I hope I can continue it. Um, I have been making strides to make it more enjoyable, make it more, you know, scenic for you guys to watch. So. Please, uh, if you can, help me. If you can't, I understand, but I just need to make sure I ask, you know. All right, I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for watching if you watch all of that. God bless you. Um, and I will see you guys later. Bye. Question of the day. If you, do you like my background? Uh, I I kind of like the caution tape. Um, let me let a girl know if you want me to rearrange something. I'll do that. But like, I spent many. <laughs> I am not a designer. I am not like a fashionista. Um, so this was like the most you'll get out of me. I promise you. Like maybe some posters are on the bottom and fill up the space. I'm okay with it. But like. I am not. <laughs> I am not designer. <laughs> but I did the best I could.